judge well thereof forever. The mouth of the righteous speaketh wisdom. Amen. And his tongue talketh of judgment. Well, that right there shows you why preachers are supposed to preach judgment. Because the word of God says that the righteous are going to speak on judgment. There is a judgment coming. And my Christian duty is to warn the wicked. Warn the wicked of the wrath of God to come. God does not want you to have his wrath. God wants to extend his now his hands of mercy. Mercy triumphs over judgment. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but through him you and I might be saved. God wants to save you. God came looking for the lost. He left the 99 to come for the one. Yesterday, a Muslim gave his life to Jesus. Oh, how Jesus loves people. Oh, he had paid a high price, dying on the cross to demonstrate the love of God. Oh, he did. It was the most beautiful portrait in the sky. The cross, the cross, the cross, the cross of Jesus Christ. Oh, it's foolishness to those of you perishing, but to those being saved, it is the power of God leading to salvation. Turn from damnation. Turn to the great pop. Turn to the great I am. The beginning and the end. Yeshua HaMashiach. The God of Israel. Jesus Christ. King of kings. Lord of lords. The word of God declares one day every knee will bow. One day every time we'll confess Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Oh, the Son came to give God glory. God glorifies His Son when Jesus was baptized. The heavens were opened. And God Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, spoke at that river Jordan. Oh, my son, in whom I'm well pleased. Is God pleased with you, sir? Yes. Is God pleased with you? Do you walk in righteousness? Do you walk in holiness? The word of God declares without holiness. No one will see the Lord. Only the pure in heart shall see God. Where do you see God, sir? Is your heart pure? Or is your heart polluted by marijuana? God did not create marijuana to make Amsterdam sin city. If God sends his wealth to Amsterdam, it's because Amsterdam deserves it. There's a lot of sin stored up in this city. The only reason God has not destroyed Amsterdam yet is because of the righteous men and women in this city. Like YWAM. The word of God is proclaimed from YWAM right there. Jesus loves you. Every day people see Jesus loves you. It's because 
it's the truth, the truth of God's word, and God wants to Wake up, Netherlands. Awake unto righteousness and sin not. God wants you white as snow, just like this Bible. What can wash away my sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus.